We all know that BMW is lagging behind its premium competition in the electric vehicle market. But that's all about to change as the company prepares to ramp up its electric car offerings, with new i5 and i7 saloons set to headline an expanded lineup of nine models that will underpin an ambitious 10-year growth plan. Hello and welcome to Tech Stack, your number one stop for all the latest tech reviews. Be sure to like, share and subscribe. And if you have any thoughts or comments, let us know down below. Now let's get into it. Climate neutral mobility in the future will be near impossible without electric drivetrains. This is the reason the BMW Group is extending its lineup of electrified automobiles. The group will start offering at least one fully electric model in almost all important sectors as early as 2023. With the new class starting in 2025, the BMW Group aims to significantly reduce its carbon footprint over the entire life cycle while increasing the delivery share of all electric vehicles to 50%. It will also make use of its expertise as an early adopter of e-mobility in doing so. A dozen fully functional all-electric vehicles will be available from the BMW Group as early as 2023, thanks to sophisticated vehicle architectures and a very adaptable production network. So, from the compact segment to the ultra-luxury class, the BMW Group will offer at least one fully electric car in almost all key series. In 2021, the all-electric range for consumers was completed with the BMW i3, Mini Cooper SE, BMW iX3, BMW i4 and BMW iX. Additionally, the manufacturer has revealed all-electric variations of the BMW 5 Series, BMW 7 Series and BMW X1. Both Rolls-Royce and Mini are steadfastly pursuing electromobility. In 2021, for instance, the fully electric Mini was the brand's best-selling model. BMW also just issued a statement in which it stated that, by the year's end, it will produce 15 battery electric vehicles BEVs, that will also include the pre-series versions produced by the Bavarian company. So, could we see BMW rival Tesla in this regard? Only time will tell. BMW reinstated that by 2025 it is aiming to provide 2 million electric vehicles in total to customers. The company claimed it is making it is making every effort to its capacity to ensure that at least 50% of BMW's deliveries throughout the world could come from BEVs before 2030. BMW will purchase huge cylindrical batteries from a Chinese company for its electric vehicles. The batteries are of similar size and capacity to the ones produced by the world's largest EV maker Tesla. According to reports, the German automaker BMW has partnered with China's EVE Energy to acquire huge cylindrical batteries for its electric vehicles sold in Europe. As a result of agreements between the two businesses, BMW now receives its battery cells primarily from the Chinese battery producer. BMW is currently aiming for larger batteries for an increased range and performance in an effort to catch up with the leaders in the global EV industry like Tesla. In the next three years, BMW intends to introduce a number of electric vehicles to the European market. The US-based electric vehicle manufacturer previously unveiled a larger format 4680 cylindrical battery with the purpose of lowering production costs and extending the range of electric vehicles. The Chinese business will shortly begin construction on a sizable cylindrical battery factory. Currently, BMW employs prismatic batteries in all of its electric vehicles, including the iX and i4. With a range of about 600 kilometers on a single charge, the BMW i4 has one of the best electric vehicle ranges in its class, and it will only get better. The larger format cylindrical batteries are expected to provide more mileage from a single charge while also keeping EV prices low. Aside EVE, BMW is also expected to receive a similar level of support from CATL, the largest battery manufacturer in the world, starting 2025. CAT has already made the decision to construct a cylindrical battery manufacturing facility in Hungary. It will be CAT's first plant in Europe and the largest on the continent, with a 100 gigawatt hour annual capacity. Mercedes-Benz, though, will be CAT's largest client. BMW, the factory is located in the same location where BMW will build a plant to make electric vehicles. Batteries are also provided to Jipeng by the Chinese firm, in addition to the German premium automakers. BMW's i model line has grown from humble beginnings with a single little car to encompass a wide range of segments, and there will be many more offerings in the future. The i3 was expensive to manufacture and probably not profitable, at least in the early stages of what became a long life cycle. Now, however, 
BMW has developed a successor into a 4.5-meter-long SUV because the public appears to accept the industry's price premium for such cars over hatchbacks and sedans. Thus, the iX1 model designation for this recently announced vehicle, with production set to begin in November at plant Regensburg. The only version of the iX1 xDrive 30, which has 64.8 kWh, usable battery and a maximum range of 438 km, all-wheel drive will be standard with a motor on each axle producing up to 313 PS with a brief boost of 494 Nm of torque. The xDrive 30 has a charging capacity of up to 130 kW. The boot capacity of the new X1 plug-in hybrids is 495 litres, rising to 1495 litres, while the ICE-only X1s have capacities of 540 and 1600 litres respectively. The iX1 should be constructed in seven years, thus a redesign will likely occur in late 2025 for the first quarter of 2026. This will be far architecture in terms of design. There will also be the new i3 and it is an electric version of the long wheelbase 3 series sedan from china completely different from the soon to be discontinued original on may 5th a new tx factory opened and that same day it produced the first i3 e drive 35l the single production facility for this vehicle which had the development code g28 bev nm is called plant lydia the 3 series ev has some distinctive features including a unique grille design and the boot capacity is lowered from 480 to 410 liters according to bmw the same single motor with 210 kilowatts and 400 newton meters that drives the ix3 is used the maximum range on the china light duty vehicle test cycle is 526 kilometers while the gross and net capacities of the catl battery pack are 70.3 and 66.1 kilowatt hours respectively in 2024, a fully electric 5 Series will also be manufactured by the BBA Dadong plant in China and the Dongolfing plant in Germany. Eight months have passed since the iX's manufacturing in Lower Bavaria began. The model is assembled in the Dingolfing facility on the same line as other vehicles with PHEV or combustion-only powertrains. For 2022 model year in North American markets, a large crossover that was about as long as broad as an X5 but as low as an X6 was introduced. The first delivery started in Germany in December 2021. The iX xDrive 40 and iX xDrive 50 models are available in several nations and a third version was introduced in January. Although the motors in the iX M60 produce a combined 455 kW and 1015 Nm torque increases to 1100 Nm in sport mode. According to BMW, the M60's 0 to 100 km per hour time is 3.8 seconds, its top speed is 250 km per hour, and its WLTP range is up to 566 km. The latter is less than the X Drive 50. The M60 looks somewhat similar to other examples of the iX, which is unusual of a M variant. It has blue brake calipers, distinctive 22-inch wheels, and a bespoke artificial sound that people seem to like for some reason. The power unit, according to its manufacturer, generates 240 kilowatts and 630 Nm in the X-Drive 40, or 385 kilowatts and 765 Nm in the X-Drive 50. The pack's reserve may be quickly charged from 200 kilowatts, going from 10 to 80%, of capacity in about 40 minutes. The high voltage battery in the X Drive 40 has a net energy content of 71 kilowatt hours, while it has a net energy content of 105.2 kilowatt hours in X Drive 50. According to the worldwide harmonized light vehicle test procedure, the X Drive 50's range is 391 miles, while the X Drive 40's is 264 miles. The first weighs 2510 kilograms DIN, whereas the second weighs 2365 kilogram DIN. Also, we can expect a 7 to 8 year life cycle, which means a facelift in 2025. The 5391 mm long i7, which was recently unveiled but is not yet in production, is one of the largest electric sedans produced by the OEM and is longer than even the long wheelbase Mercedes EQS hatchback. The i7 X Drive 60 will be the only model available at launch later in 2022, although an i7 M70 X Drive will follow in 2023. These EVs are the most expensive 7 Series models that BMW is offering. It will have a 107 kilowatt hour battery, 190 kilowatt front and 230 kilowatt rear motors, 400 kilowatt and 745 Nm of combined output, standard AWD, and a top speed of 240 km per hour. The i7 will be the only model available in Europe when the launches begin in November, the 7 series will come after. However, both will touch down simultaneously in North America and China. 
It sure looks like BMW is set to rival Tesla and not even the global chip shortage can stop them. So you should definitely watch out for these vehicles because BMW sure knows how to take care of its consumers. Which of these vehicles are you most excited to see? Let us know down in the comment section.